Now I'll be showing you how to do the install for the first time for S Manager software. Go to Hondata.com to ensure they do have the latest version of the software. Click on the Downloads tab, left hand side, and choose S Manager software. Follow the steps. Once Windows finishes doing the install, it will automatically detect your S Manager software and just follow the steps. Once all the install has done, click on the finish tab. Your help file would open. Accept the license agreement. Once the install is done, your software will open automatically. Next step is we're gonna be doing the install drivers. In order to register your S300, and in order to do that, you will also need NEDIT access. Your next step will be to connect your S300 via USB from your laptop to the S300 unit. Windows will automatically detect your S300. To confirm that your drivers are installed, check the bottom left hand side of your screen. It should say drivers installed. Next, we're going to click on the S300 tab followed by a register owner. On your register tab, you will need to fill out your name. Email. VIN number. Phone number. address the last step will be update S300 with owner details followed by register S300 with Honda keep in mind all these steps will require for you to have internet access Next, I'll be showing you how to upload a startup calibration. Click on your new calibration tab. Choose any of the calibrations closest to your setup. Select. Click OK. Switch to the second ignition. Followed by the arrow facing up. Once it's been uploaded, you may switch the ignition off and you may turn the vehicle on. If you wish to view any of the parameters from that calibration, you may click on the parameters tab, top, middle of your screen. And here is all the parameters for that calibration.